Congratulations on starting your course with Think Real Estate. We're gonna spend the next couple of minutes making sure you're absolutely clear on how to navigate the online system to make it a lot easier for you as you go through your course. Now to start off with, we need to log in. So where you wanna to go to is thinkrealestate.net.au and then up the top right hand side, we wanna click into the login button where you can enter in the email and the password that you have created. Or if you're unsure of which password it is, you can always click the forgot your password tab and reset it if you need it at any time. Now when you log in, you're gonna see your home screen or your dashboard. Now this is gonna show a couple of different items that you can see on here. First things first is you will certainly notice that your course is gonna appear on the top right hand side. And that is where you're able to enter into your course and certainly begin the units or topics that you need to complete. One thing that might happen at this point in time is that your profile might come up with a message up the top which says it, your profile isn't 100% complete. Now, if this does come up, it's really important that we go to our profile tab under my profile and fill in all of the information in there, your name, your address, and anything else that might be required. Coming back to your dashboard, it's really important we understand all of the facets on here. One of the things that might help you get through your course is that we also have a tab here where you can look for the next tutorial or class or webinar that might help you get through that particular topic or unit. Coming back to the dashboard, there's a really important part to this dashboard that we wanna make sure that you're aware of. Because if you're going through your course and you're struggling for whatever it may be, there are ways in which you can get help. These ways could include that you could certainly send a message to your trainer or your assessor, and you can do that via the messages tab. When you click into the messages tab, you can compose a new message, and you can send that certainly to any of the trainers or assessors that we may have available for you. Now, if you're unsure whom to send it to, there is a little button atop that says, don't know who to send your message to. If you click that, that will give you a list of all the trainers and which units or topic they focus on. So if you're stuck, stuck on one particular unit, find that unit and then you'll know who to send that message to. On top of sending a message to an assessor, we also have the ability for you to be able to book in a one-on-one -on -one time with a trainer as well. You can do that up the top right hand side and that will come up certainly with some dates and times that are available that would suit you and the trainer that you can obviously meet up and talk about a particular unit or topic or issue that you might be having. And then the last thing, which certainly might help you even more, is that we have the ability to be able to book in a tutorial, a class, or a webinar that focuses in on a particular unit or topic. And you'll see that down the bottom right-hand side of your screen, and you can certainly click into those and book in there straight away as well. Circling back to the course that you're just about to start, you'll find that up the top right-hand side of the dashboard. You might even find some previous courses that you've completed with us as well. If they are completed, the certificate on the right hand side might be green and that's just where you can click that green certificate and download the statement or certificate from the course that you've completed. When you click into the course that you're about to start, which should say in progress, you'll see a video up the top of that page. It's really important you watch that video as well as this one because that might give you some more information about the course that you're, or the specific course that you're about to start. Then when you look below that video, you will be able to see the parts of the course that you can start. And certainly the units will be there for you as well. When you click into that unit, that is where you'll be certainly able to find all of the resources that you can use to learn. They might be videos or PDFs that you will see all together. And then that below them is where you can start the assessments that go along with them. So that gives you an idea on how to navigate the online training system Thank you for choosing Think Real Estate and good luck with your course.